Riding Mountain Park is a fairly large park, about 3,000 square kilometres. The National Park System manages a campground here, just beside the town of Wassa Gaming. There are nearly 370 kilometres of trails throughout the park. In winter, they can also be used for cross-country skiing, snowshoeing, or fat biking. For a more adventurous trip, there are backcountry campsites available too. Wassa Gaming is a popular tourist attraction. It's located about 100 kilometres north of Brandon, Manitoba in Canada, and it's within the Riding Mountain National Park. The Wassa Gaming Campground is minutes from the main beach area and pier, restaurants, playground area, tennis courts, lawn bowling, visitor centre, walking and biking trails, canoe, kayak and bike rentals, horseback riding, 18-hole golf course, shopping and much more. The public beach is a short walk from the Wassa Gaming Campground through the cute little town with tourist shops and a visitor centre. There are 427 sites in this campground, including some pull-through sites and sites with full hookups, sewer, water and electricity that can accommodate larger rigs. The campground is open from mid-May to mid-October, although they do have some sites and Authentics open for winter camping. They also offer sites for those with disabilities. There are many campsites with electricity and Wassa Gaming Campground offers Authentics, yurts and micro cubes if you're not wanting to tent or RV. Authentics are A-frame cabins and come with three sleeping platforms for up to six campers and a dining table. Some Authentics have wood stoves inside if you are camping during the cooler season. Though that may sound cozy and maybe even romantic, a wood stove can also mean that you're waking up every few hours during the night to check on the fire. You still need to bring your own bedding and cooking and eating utensils and cook stove. Yurts are tent-like structures on a wood floor and they house a maximum of two adults. There's a dumping station, washrooms with hot showers and some kitchen shelters. Wasa Gaming also has two unserviced camping areas. All of the sites have a fire pit and picnic table. Group camping is at site 218 and has a 15 person maximum. There's electricity and a kitchen area and bathrooms nearby and it's in close proximity to the beach and town. There is a visitor center with many educational and entertaining displays. We enjoyed walking some trails and seeing some wildlife. Just make sure to lock up your food to protect the animals and yourselves. There are great walking trails, picnic areas, and warming pavilions. Riding Mountain Park is huge, and we only spent our time in the area around the Wassa Gaming Campground and town. We were impressed with the campground and really enjoyed everything we did here. Until next time, looking forward to seeing you on the road. Check out some of our other videos and subscribe to our channel. New content will be posted weekly.